I found it. It's the Megamycete. Okay. Welcome back, everybody. Alpha to squad. I've located the Megamycete. So now we can end this mess after all. About damn time. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be that simple. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. And we didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. I mean, yeah. What was the plan exactly? This must be Miranda's lab. <laughs> What's up with all these books? All right, there looks it looks like there's a lot of shit here, so I'm just going to open everything, put it on the screen if you want to read it. Go for it. I'll read it uh later when I'm editing. Um as much as I like lore and shit, I'm not going through all of this right now. So And I'm sure some of it's related to Seven anyway, so I probably wouldn't fucking understand all of it. Is that her with her fucking the doll baby thing? What the fuck is this? Dear Miranda, my deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor half-dead medical student in the snow. I have always cherished the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. I was inspired by your research to think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism. Positively visionary. <clears throat> I knew that with the knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Oh my god. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusps, cusps of another, my conviction never wa wavered. <clears throat> I realized, however, though, the, the many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared that your conviction differed from mine. You hoped to bring back a single dead person while I aimed to change the world. Your experiments on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. That was fucked up. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution. The pro... Pro progenitor? A virus found in Africa. That's the fucking... I, I watched, like, a video recapping everything. That's, like, the um, fucking plant, right, that started everything, I believe. Uh, I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus's research. I will call it Umbrella. Oh, the, you're the fucking cunt. Just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I am one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday too. You taught me so much and that and for that I will be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student Oswell Oswell E. Spencer. Spencer, here. No way. Wow. Okay.
My Ava, it's been 100 years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then, but now now I can bring you back to life from the Megamind. Whatever. The Megamind. Fuck you. I had to test your new vessel's regenerative abilities. I took her apart and received her, revived her in the Megamind. Regulatory and giant chalice. All that is left is to merge her with the Megamind. Mega the ceremony can finally be... Okay, so she's trying to bring back her, like, actual daughter? <laughs> After I lost you, I was stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I so wanted to be with you again, and that's when I found it, the Megamind, completely by accident. When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Megamind breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew that if your consciousness was in there, too... Then there would be a way to bring you back. I just needed the right vessel. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with mold from the Megamite. That way I could control them, experiment on them. I have experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I even tried to increase the efficiency of finding a vessel by creating a parasite I called Kado. Yet none of my experiments came to fruition. There were some like Al Alcina who were close to being perfect, but most turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organism who said they were they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA, but all they created was another defect, Evelyn. Then again, not a complete failure, I learned of Rose thanks to them, and I knew she would be the perfect vessel. There was some in interference but I was able to verify her stability suitability now my research is finally complete Eva I have waited too long to see you again okay all right Show me your hands! Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. <coughs> it really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? I was caught in Houston experiments. In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. She's not Mia. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. Something's wrong. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is gone. I couldn't save him, but I can save Rose. Come on, it's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. Fucking knew it. Or did I? <clears throat> what the fuck is going on? What? Uh, 
Uh, yeah, oh uh, yeah. Oh fuck. So it's there. It's cold. Am I barefoot? Well, probably not. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. This shit, my body. I mean, you're d dead, so like. Yeah. Is that Evelyn? Evelyn? How are you here? Oh! Dead. No? Wait. Was Evelyn from Seven? I mean, Miranda. She. No. I still have to save Rose. <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What? What are you saying? I can still... What is happening? See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Remember? Three years ago, the Baker House. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. That, that's, that's impossible. No way. You shouldn't even be able to walk around. I mean, I can't right now. You shouldn't be walking. I'm not. <laughs> so. What? What am I? I. I. I did all that. <laughs> Rose. Mia. I. My brain hurts. I didn't even know I had one until now. Cause it's just, it, it's. What the fuck? What the fuck? So. No, no more plot. No more think. Oh! <laughs> At last, 
he awakes. Fuck off, Duke. Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. <sighs> Duke, your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. Thanks. I think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. That doesn't mean anything. Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assume as much and I'm already on the way. We should arrive shortly. Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. Yes. Foolish of me to ask. A little bit. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? Yeah. I have to be. I gotta go. Thanks, Duke. Um, why is he not under her control or and allowed to be like, what the fuck? Have there been good molds before? I really should have played seven. Do I need to bother attacking you? I have nothing to attack you with. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh. Oh, I have my shit. Oh, really? That's just all kinds of disturbing. What? Oh. My power is leaving me. Rose. Miranda. Interesting. Your body certainly is a normal. Well, yeah. Give Rose to me. No! You will see. Once I kill you properly, every- Get her now! <sighs> Let go! Get off. I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. Mm, no. My desires will be fulfilled. Son of a bitch. Rose is All Ethan had to do was like turn around. What the fuck? Oh crap. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Nicholas. Now, please do not worry for little Rose. I assure you I'll provide her with truth. 
How do I hurt so you? Now you can die Not let you get away. Why would you get Ah fuck. Where's the other guy that just shot her in the face? I shall finish this. Ah fuck. Uh oh uh oh. Ah oh, shit. Fuck me. Wait, what? Would you like to change difficulty to casual? No. Not yet. Oh. Oh, I could have bought shit from him. Yeah, I might do that. Especially healing shit. Do I even have anything to fucking... Do I have any money anywhere? Don't make me do this all over again. Thank you. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Megamycete. Do I, I have no shotgun ammo? Now, please, dipshit. Little rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true happiness. So now you can die. Not let you get away. Ah, fuck. <gasps> Alright, I gotta fucking visit Duke. Yeah, see, I have nothing to. Crystal Heisenberg, cigar. It. Uh, no. I don't think the mines are going to do anything, so I'm not going to bother with that. Did I buy more Magnum ammo? Can I even do that, or do I have to find that shit? I guess I have to just find it. Shit. No, dipshit. Um, any gun that I can upgrade the power and I'm going to do that. Yeah, what the hell. All right, let's try this again. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Megamycete. Now, please do not worry, the little Rose. I assure you I'll provide her with true happiness. So now you can die peacefully. Not let you get away. Oh, okay, so she'll wait for me to stop guarding too. There's nothing. I shall finish this. Move. Ah, fuck. I should have one more hit, right? Before I need to do that. I guess I should... Oh. 
Okay, that's interesting. Um, I only have one of those, so I really don't want to waste it. Fuck, where am I? Oh shit, hi. Okay, time to use this. There's shit around here that I can get. Your time is up. Now die. I've never seen a human. Fuck, stop doing that. Human live without his heart. Are you sure you're not? Yeah, it certainly is. Fire and shit. Oh, damn it. I don't need handgun ammo, motherfucker. I need health. After all, everyone dies. Yeah, but I really don't want to die. <laughs> Fuck me. I'm alive. Okay. I can take any form I Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Rose is truly my I might have to change the difficulty for this. One more time and then I'm doing that. I just don't have the fucking healing supplies. Ah, uh, little Ava, my beautiful daughter. Oh yeah, I don't you care. fulfilled your purpose. Dismissed the winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Mega. Okay, so that got that over with quick. Good. Now, please do not worry, for little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true weapons. So now you can die peacefully. You understand the love of a queen. Not let you get away. How can you deny me? Why Shit. I would hope this is more powerful than that. Rose but. is my goddamn kid, not yours. I shall put you to rest. Come on, bitch. This Okay, I'm doing better. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive you nuts. Where'd you go? Die. 
fuck. Can I deflect this shit? What is that? Oh, oh, oh. Got it. Okay. Ugh. One more of those and then I gotta heal. Come on. Fuck. I can take any form I desire. Feel the dark. Yeah, shut up. Um Oh, fuck me. What the fuck? <laughs> now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in mind. Wow, that almost has a halfway decent rate of fire now. Of course, it's empty. If I combine rooms with a mega my daughter will be made. Ah, fuck. Last. I've waited a century. A century. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck you. Oh, it didn't work. Okay, cool. Please be health. Shit. All right, I'll take it. I've never seen a human live without his heart. How are you sure you're not? Get away from me. Why do you interfere? Surely you have no means now. So no death. She's my goddamn daughter. You psycho. I missed. Shit. Fuck you. Please give me some fucking health here. Such fight. Can I not make any? Fuck. Just need an herb. Damn it. That was dumb. Ah, fuck. <sighs> Alright, I'm changing the difficulty. <clears throat> if I had fucking two hours to spend on this shit, I could do it, but, I mean, maybe. My Shut up. Daughter. Shut the fuck up. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Megalizers. Hold on, what am I doing? Now, please do not worry for little Rose. I assure you I'll provide her with... So now you can die peacefully. You understand I the love of a parent. Do not let you get away. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn kid, not yours? Wow, that's a lot better. It granted me this splendid power. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive you nuts. Oh wait, no, aim assist is not good in this situation. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Oh great mega mice. Hear my prayer. Alright. Die, die, die! <laughs> I will take 
It's not your daughter. <laughs> I understand your feelings, Miss Truly. But this is the If I combine Rose with a Mega Mindset, my daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. A century! All for this. Get behind the fucking tree. You still stand. Wait, do I have anything in here? Am I fucking stupid? No. She's my goddamn daughter. You psycho. Why? I will see my hopes. I must. Will you fuck off? Shit, uh oh. Why do you persist in this? <clears throat> I got one more, right? Oh, I have more shotgun ammo. Fucking moron. Oh, and the fucking pipe bomb. You dumb bitch. Those films, they could do nothing to assuage oh, you're flying right now. Ever think the problem might be you, Miranda? You're not capable of real love. <laughs> ah, fuck you, idiot. Run, 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 run. Ah, you fuck. Wait. Why? That did nothing. Why won't you die? Wow, I have a ton of shotgun ammo, huh? Or not shotgun, sniper. I can't hit that fucking eye. Okay. Holy shit. Do I have to go to... No, I have the day off. Holy fuck. <clears throat> Jesus, that scared me. More than anything. Holy shit. <laughs> Rose. Shh. Shh. It's is it just me or does she kind of look like Duke? Just like chubby, I guess. Ah, uh, My hand. Ethan! Ethan! Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up. Oh, no. Chris. Ethan. You did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move.
It had to be my hand, huh? Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. 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 <laughs> And you tell yourself. Now oh, come on, it's not that much further. Watch over. Huh. Teach her to be strong. God damn it. Goodbye, Rosemary. Ethan. <laughs> well, this is just sad. Take us up now! Wait! Where's Ethan? He really didn't make it this time. Moving. We have to get clear. No! We can't go! Not without my husband! Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. I know he wouldn't abandon us. Tell me he didn't have a choice, on. but like, kind of did. There he is. What was that? I told you to sit down. Where is he? <laughs> Window loading. Chris, what have you done? He's gone. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. The hell were they thinking? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. Someone's got to pay. Damn. Is there like a post credit scene or something I'm waiting for? Yeah. Maybe.
Well, thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate uh, all your support. Probably should have played 7 before I did this, but uh, hey, whatever. Um, maybe I'll do that. At, I'm sure I'll do that at some point. I really want to get into these more. Um, I'd like to go back to like 1 and play them all the way through, but... Maybe I should just play them in backwards order, but I'm not gonna do that. That would be that would be dumb. Um, oh, there's an actual song to this. We gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. Even now, the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Shit. Well, I'm glad we didn't, like, read the whole story, because I would have, you know, pretty much ruined the ending, but... Although I tried my best to do that all the way through anyway, but...
Uh oh. I knew it. Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon, it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like a human. I think it does. <laughs> is this Rose? Oh shit, it is. Going to visit. Yeah. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? It's a day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. That was a dick fucking joke. Stand down. What the fuck do you mean you have a clear shot? She's just a kid. <sighs> Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know? I know. Oh, there's DLC to this, isn't there? Ooh. Is it spooky, though? I mean, I don't care. I can handle it. I mean, if I can... Whatever. Did this... Okay. The father's story is now done. Time for the daughter's story. The daughter's story has just begun? Am I supposed to press something here? Okay. Eight hours, 13 minutes, and 17 seconds? That's not bad. It wasn't all casual, you fucking asshole. That's just because I changed the last part. Fuck you. Fuck you. Why do my hands smell like weed? Okay, well, I'll look into doing the DLC. Maybe we will do that. Maybe we're back to the other stuff. I don't know, but I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, and have a good day, everybody. Hey guys, thank you very much for watching. If you like that video, do me a favor and check out another one. I'd appreciate it very much. If you like true crime slash cooking, do me a favor, check out my friend Doug's channel, Crime and Dine. There will be a link somewhere in the description. I'd appreciate it a lot. Now back to the other me. A couple other things, just real quick. Um, if you're ever thirsty, if you ever want an energy drink, something, you know, give you a little boost, no jitters, nothing like that, just some good flavor and good energy, try some W over here, um, go to their website, put in Hopper 10, you get 10% off everything, and um, every time, for if you buy one of the shakers that I got with the tree on it, they'll actually plant a tree. So that's nice. So anything you get, 10% off.
of my code. Hopper 10. Just saying, yeah. Um, if you're looking for some good music, a couple links in the description for my friend, Maxwell T. He makes uh, some good R&B rap songs. Definitely check those out. You're actually hearing one right now. So if you like it, go listen to more. Uh, that's all. Thank you very much and have a good day, everybody.